Alright everybody, welcome back to another Steam free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have Guilt Free, which is a visual novel point-click, which has five endings. So I'm going to do my best to find all five, but it's going to take me forever. So buckle up if you want to watch the whole thing. Um, I'll try to edit it out if I get lost or anything like that. As always, I'll leave a link to the game in the description. I'm also going to leave a link to my homie's channel, Marxies, so you guys can support him as well. He's another gaming channel that puts out great content. If you like the video, please like and subscribe. Alright, let's crack into this. This is supposed to be like a relationship or something. Am I the dude or the chick? And that's when I got on the space tiger and rode away into the sunset, literally. Oh wow. What a wild dream, right? Drugs? <laughs> Babe? Babe, you okay? Okay, I'm the dude. What? Sorry, I spaced out for a while. Yeah, I saw. You didn't care about my space tiger story? What the? Okay. It's my bad. I really sh I shouldn't really be bothering you with stupid stuff. Hey, you're not bothering me. Well, then stop blanking out, chick. Oh, her mouth moves. That's kind of scary. I like hearing about your dreams. Your weird, messed up dreams. <laughs> I feel attacked. Sorry, I'm just kind of distracted today. What's on your mind? Nothing, really. I don't know. Hmm? She's cheating on me. No, I can't think of anything. Maybe it's work. You know you can talk to me, right? Of course, it's nothing really, until it becomes something and then we won't talk about it and you'll break up with me. I'm feeling it. Just a bit tired recently and it's been hard to focus. Actually, I'm gonna get ready for bed now. Already? You sure you're fine? Yeah, I just wanted to read a bit. Alright, I'll join you later then. Yeah. Hmm. I know Alice said she was fine, but something was clearly bothering her. Time to get busy, baby! Let's go to the bedroom. She's been like this for some time now, quiet and a bit distant. Maybe I shouldn't push too much. She always tells me when she's upset. I'm sure she'll say something when she feels up for it. Oh! Her dinner is still on the table. More than half is left. Not again. I'll clean up for her. Okay, let's look at the trash can real quick. Ah, look at that. That's cool. He was fed already. What about my phone? Is that her phone? Messages? Uber Feast, thank you for your order. Your John driver John is on the way. Your verification code is one, two, three. Wow, that's a crappy verification code, Google. Way to freaking batten down the hatch of John freaking. I absolutely love this picture. My phone just went off. What's up? Wait, my phone went off. Why did it do the badoo badoo? Nothing? Okay, whatever. Oh! Oh! Wow, she's got... <laughs> the people's eyebrow dog. Okay, that's cool. I dig it. Do I have any other photos I can look through? That's it for right now? Okay, sick. Um, can I play some music? No, of course not. Music app's grayed out. What about Instabook? What is that? Is that Instagram phone? Oh, I can't click that either. Mom door code. Sorry, I'm just looking through everything, so hopefully it'll be a little bit easier when I'm trying to get the other ending. This was definitely my best holiday ever. I always wanted to go to Spain, and I'm so glad I did it with Alice. For the first time, the food was amazing. The wine was even better. I like how friendly and relaxed people were as well. We definitely need to go again. It was the perfect mix of exploring and beach holidays, but to be fair, everything was with her is great and fun. I'm so happy I met this girl. Aw, too bad. She's gone. Future wife, is that Alice? Not now, maybe later. Mom? Okay, okay, we're not calling anybody, I got you. How did you get my friend Andrew's phone number in your phone? Andrew, I'm not sure who this guy is, it's my friend. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, okay. What else? We, uh, let's just put up the dishes. Uh, how about put them in the trash can? Wouldn't that have been tragic? All clean, there's my good deed for the day. I wonder if Alice is feeling any better. I'm sick of worrying. I'll just ask her what's wrong. That's a terrible idea, fam. But we should. Let's do it. Which way are we going? This right way? It's kitty cat. Hey, buddy. Where's she at? She's not even in bed. Where are you at, girl? Hmm? She's in the bathroom. She's calling someone on the phone. Hold on, though. What's that sound? Is she crying? No, it's more like she's throwing up. Oh, she's maybe pregnant. Baby, are you okay? I'm going in. 
What's going on? Babe? I'm coming in. No, please don't. What the hell? The door's locked. Tell me what's happening. Are you sick? I'm fine. I'll be out in a second. I heard you throwing up. Are you not feeling well? Babe! I can hear her brushing her teeth. Why did she lock the door? We never do that. Hey, what's going on? I... I don't know. It must have been something in the food. I'm fine now. Food, but she barely touched it. Did you throw up? Yeah, a bit. What do you mean, a bit? I mean, calm down. It's nothing. I feel better now. Look at that furrowed eyebrow. She's pissed. But... I'm going to bed. Why did she just snap at me like that? Did I overreact? But I was just worried. Everyone would be, right? Oh, it's tragic. What's my phone got to say about this? Nothing? Okay, thanks phone, you're useful. Back. Get out of my side of the bed, Mr. Kitty Cat. Or die. For magazines. Is there anything else I can look at here? Ah, bedtime. I want to write about what happened before I go to sleep. I'm worried about Alice. She's been quiet. She's been distant. She hasn't even... hasn't been eating properly. When I ask her about it... Oh god, I scrolled on exit. She always says she's fine, just tired or stressed about work. I don't believe her. She hasn't said much about work. I have a diary in my phone. That's weird. The way she would when she had a tough project or a difficult co-worker. Alice, what are you hiding? Are you having doubts about us? After what happened today, I think it's something else. I mean, she was sewing up. The fact that she snapped at me afterwards is even more suspicious. As if I did something wrong. Worrying about her. Does she think I would just keep quiet? What's gotten into her? Maybe, could she be pregnant? Mood change, throwing up? But isn't that meant to happen in the mornings? This would be so much easier if she ta just talked to me. I can't believe she'd hide being pregnant. Maybe she's not happy about it. Ah, screw this overthinking. I need to talk to her. Wish she didn't pretend to be asleep when I came to bed. As if I can't tell. You know what to do, then. Shake the shit out of her. Shake the shit out of her. <laughs> oh. Ah, I'm beat. I had some messed up dreams last night. Maybe I should tell Alice about my space tiger. Alice has already left for work. I was sleeping so hard that I didn't even wake up. I wonder how she's feeling today. I hope she's feeling better. Anyways, it's breakfast time. What's this? Probably decided to go with another one. Wait. Her bag. I prefer pockets. I don't know what it is with girls in their handbags. Now look at it. Okay. Now I can't. Weird. What's behind this? My graduation party. Man, Joe looks so different. I remember hanging, haggling over this painting at some farmer's market. That's all I'd do. Look. Okay, I got you. Let me go! X button. Is there anything else I can look at? What's this? Oh, it's our holiday in Spain. We used to travel so much more. Yeah, I had that on my phone. Did I get a new photo? I did. <laughs> the beach, the bikini pic, boy, we're doing it for magazines. I already looked at that. Okay, next room. Time to make breakfast. Oh, it's Mr. Kitty Cat. So hungry. What to eat? What to eat? I don't know. I feel lazy. Let's just go for some cereal. I want to talk to the cat. Ah, uh, Dante, I didn't see you there. That's a good name for that cat. He looks like a Dante. Why are you hiding like that, you sneaky boy? Ah, uh, my little crouching tired. <laughs> Crouching hiding tiger. <laughs> Crouching tiger hidden dragon. Can't eat cereal without the cereal. I guess he's not hungry now. Well, I can open the trash can at all times, which is nice, I guess. I absolutely love this picture. Don't play with sharp objects. Okay. You got any cereal in here? This is cereal? Yeah, look at that. We're doing it. I need a bowl. Where do I keep the bowls in this house? This one won't open, so. What about this bowl in the sink? Is it not clean? 
We need the milk. We need a bowl. Ah, uh, milk fit for a king. So, or so I tell myself. Let's dig in. Much better now. I should clean up. Alice won't be impressed if I leave a mess. True. See, I'm so thoughtful. Oh, Alice left her bowl as well. She must have been in a hurry. Ah, she had cereal as well. Great minds think alike. But hold on, something isn't right. I'm pretty sure the cereal box was full when I took it. How come she... I should check the cupboards. This one. Oh, what are we looking for? This is a cereal I had. The same kind that she left a bit of in the sink. But barely any cereal is gone. Pretty sure it was full when I took it. Did we have two boxes? I should check out the bin. What the hell am I doing? I can't explain why, but I feel like something is really not right. Oh well, at least there's nobody here to judge me. No cereal box in here. There were a few bits of the cereal in the bowl that she left, but the bowl box was basically untouched. And it's the only box we had. It kind of looks like she faked it. She dying? Baked eating cereal? What the hell is this theory? This is ridiculous. Why am I playing Sherlock in my own house? I should just clean up this mess and get on with my stuff. But what if she actually did? She did actually fake it. Why would she fake it? Maybe she didn't want me to worry because of yesterday. Yet throw up after all. Jesus Christ, I need to stop being paranoid. She probably ate a tiny bit and barely made a difference in that box. I really need to talk to her. Overthinking won't help me with anything. She'll be back in the afternoon. I'll just get on with life until then. I should actually get some work done. I've been postponing this project for too long. I think I left my laptop in the living room. What's up, Dante? Oh, kitty cat. Where the hell is the living room at? How do I get to the living room? This way? Okay. That little light stain on the floor is the living room. I don't feel like watching TV. I wish I had more time to play games. Aha! I do not look good in this picture, period. Oh, I didn't get the picture on my phone. I never really understood art, but this is nice. This picture is from our first trip together. I only take pictures of her. I don't keep the pictures of that I have. <laughs> Old Dora the Explorer with her backpack. <laughs> oh, Lord. It's outside. I don't feel like going out right now. I don't know how I get different endings, because all this seems like the same stuff. Mail. Back on Thursday. Hello from Switzerland. I love it here, but it's been so long. I miss home. Just love... Just to remind you, I'm arriving on Thursday, so I expect both of you to spend some time with me over dinner. Love, Mom. Free three-month contract. Hi there. All this sounds great. I talked with the team, and we are very happy to move forward with this. Are you free sometime this week to meet and discuss details over coffee? Thanks, George. 60% off flight trips to Europe. Special offer. All October flights to Europe, 60% off. This weekend only, so don't miss out. Flying fly team. Oh, we're going to Spain, so she can stop being mad at me. Left phone at home. Hey, baby, I just realized I left my phone at home, so don't worry if I don't message back XX. We'll be back around 6 30 p.m and i'll pick up some chinese on the way home so don't worry about cooking love love who can't scroll it tragic okay whatever we need to find her phone we need to find her phone so we can look at it goggles goggles okay now oh my god i'm a coder god please no i hope he does it himself all right i need to plan some stuff for this new project Thank God. Sometime later. Ah, it's turning out to be more complicated than I thought. It always does, bro. It always does. I think I should draw it out on paper. It might make it more clear. How? Okay, you do it. Shit! Where's my pen? I can't find it anywhere. I'll just grab one from Alice's handbag. She always has tons of them. And we can take her phone, and we can look through it. It's genius. There's no way that backfires whatsoever. Never backfires. Chicks love it when you look through their stuff. Ha! Found some chocolate bar wrappings. Guilty. Actually, there's a lot of them here. One, two, three. How many are there? She doesn't often eat sweets, though. Or anything at all, recently. Well, at least not while I'm around. 
You must have been pretty stressed out to munch on so many. If that's true, why didn't she mention anything? I really need to talk to her. She should be back in a few hours. I'll just keep myself busy with work till then. Now I feel guilty about looking into her bag. I don't think she would have wanted me to see that. Bro, it's just the chocolate. But what's done is done, I guess. At least I found that pen. But let's look at her cell phone, maybe. Probably decided to go... Oh, okay, whatever, dude. This guy's way too honest. It's way more honest than I like my visual novel characters to be. Oh, Dante, what are you doing, buddy? Hey, buddy boy. How's my Dante? Oh, you're too cute and fluffy. Oh, I love fluffy waffle gifts. <laughs> okay. Get back to the thing. Code. Okay, let's tackle this beast. Wait a second. Go back. I wanted to read my emails, actually. A few hours later. I think I have a better idea where this is go where we're going with this now. Oh crap, Alice will be back soon. I'll make a start on dinner. No, she she's getting dinner. She, dummy. Yo, dog. She said she's right here, dude. She's getting dinner. We don't need to make dinner. We need to find her phone. Dante! <laughs> oh, okay. Time to work my magic. But she's getting Chinese food, you non-reading fool. Ah, uh, I should win awards for this risotto. Risotto. I don't get why people think it's so easy to make. It might be. But it takes finesse. It takes patience. I bet if I went on Master Chef, they would appreciate it. I don't know, Gordon Ramsay's pretty picky about his risotto, man. Ha, huh, I might even win and get famous. You should do it on Hell's Kitchen. He always cooks risotto. That's a career plan if my gig doesn't work out. I'm home. Oh, hey, babe. How was work? It was okay. At least it went by fast. Had some fun customers today. Oh, yeah? How about you tell me all about it over a romantic dinner, my love? She got Chinese food. Why do you sound so smug all of a sudden? Did you make risotto and you're feeling Italian again? How dare you speak to me like that? This is not merely... A risotto. It's music for my soul. I hate to break it to you, but it's rice with some veg. You're breaking my heart. You're killing me. Anyway, hungry? Oh yes, I haven't eaten since lunch. I'm starving. That's what I like to hear. She seems better. Maybe she just had a bad day yesterday. So tell me some stories. What happened today? Well, Lisa asked if I wanted to grab lunch together, so we went to this little cafe. I ordered a, co a coffee and a sandwich, but it wasn't very big. It was more of a gourmet place. Yeah, was it good? Yes, it was It was with avocado and tomatoes and rocket leaves. Hmm, sounds great. Yeah, and it was whole meal bread and toasted, so it was quite healthy. And I asked them not to add any sauces. Man, she's really describing that sandwich. Was it really that good? Sounds pretty basic. Yeah, sounds good. Glad you found a nice place. Yeah, it was nice. I think you would like it there. You could do some work from there. I might. Working from home gets dull sometimes. Oh, and Kate came back from her trip today. Oh, yeah? She's been away for a while, hasn't she? Yeah, she took a month off to travel. You met this new guy during your trip, and she seemed very happy. Why do you look all sad now? Spare me the details of that part, please. <laughs> huh, I don't know much more. We don't didn't get to talk a lot. Did lose a lot of weight, though. Hmm, I guess she did a lot of walking and exploring. Yeah, I guess so. I think so. She also got a haircut with the, and an obviously nice tan. She looks so different. Wow, sounds like a full transformation. Good for her. She wants to transform too. You gotta go do something with her. Let's go walking with her door the Explorer backpack, bro. Yeah. Everything okay? Yes, I'm fine. Just, I'm just a bit tired. I'm gonna chill for a bit. You're not gonna finish e going to finish eating? Oh no, I'm full now. Thank you. She's trying to lose weight and... Oh, she's bulimic. It was lovely. You're welcome. I'm pretty sure she said she was starving when she came back. She only ate about half of it. If it's not that much. Is she worried about something? 
Maybe I shouldn't bring up the cereal. But the vomiting yesterday. If she didn't feel good, then fine. But I need to know if it's there's a more important reason for that. Maybe, maybe I should. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't do that. That's a no go. I should ask about her period. That is a big no no. Rule number one is you do not ask about the period. Bam! <laughs> Buzzer sound boy. What? No. What kind of idea is that? A terrible one. I need to talk to her, but I don't want to upset her. It's a tough one. Damn, I take a lot of pictures, boy. He was fed already. Beat him again! Dante needs to put on weight, man. Okay, I guess we go do the thing, because it really doesn't seem like looking at the objects is really doing much for me, to be honest. Okay, let's go to the... Where's she at? Is she in the bathroom again throwing up? Oh. Huh. Is she in the living room? Oh crap, I clicked the wrong thing. What about her bag? Okay, back to the kitchen. I have no idea how we'll get different endings in this game, to be honest. Dante! Okay, same answers. What's up, girl? Hey, babe. Yeah? Are you feeling okay? Yeah, why? Well, there's... That's what I wanted to ask. You know, after yesterday, I'm, yes, I'm better. I need an angle to approach her. Something bothering you? You threw up yesterday, didn't you? Well, we know that. We already know that one. Something bothering you? She's so... I'm worried about your eating. What? What do you mean? I mean, you've been barely eating recently. Don't finish your meals. Is there something on your mind? No, it's nothing. It's... I'm... I've just not been hungry, you know? That's cool, but that's not how you normally are. I'm worried. I'm just worried, you know? No, I know. Um, I just... I guess it's because of stress or something. I've had a lot on my mind. Stress? Did something happen at work? No, nothing happened. It's just... I don't know. I just don't feel very hungry. There's definitely something going on. Just not saying it. Should I ask about something more specific? Or just let it go? We should really shouldn't tell her we went through a bag. Did you eat breakfast? God. Did you eat breakfast today? Of course. Well, wow, that was quick. I mean, yeah, I did. I had cereal, some cereal this morning. Why? You don't have to hide things from me. I know she's stressed out already, but I need to know the truth. You don't have to hide things from me, you know that. I'm on your side. I, I know. It's just that, hmm? I just have been, I keep thinking about putting on weight and I get worried and stressed out. Ah, figured. I guess that's why I haven't been eating properly. Baby, come here. You know there's nothing to worry about. You're beautiful. But thank you. Glad you told me. Now at least I understand what's going through your head. But thank you. I know it wasn't easy on you. I'm the freaking best, boys. I nailed this. I'm sorry. You have nothing to be sorry about. Don't apologize. I'm really worried, though. I know, baby. We'll deal with it, okay? Just remember, I'm here for you. Okay. I'm the freaking best. That was best case scenario. Look at us. We did this. I'm really worried about her. It seems like she's been struggling with food recently. She says she's worried about putting on weight. That explains her weird behavior and how she's not been eating, throwing up as well. I just hope it's not very serious. I'll keep an eye on her and try not to upset her with the, anything. I'm glad we talked about this. There's no way I would have figured it out on my own. At least I can try to support her the best I can. And now that we've talked, she seems to have realized that I'm on her side. 
I think she was afraid I would judge her because of it. I need to make sure she remembers I'm, I, I love her and that I'm here for the long haul. We freaking did it! Oh, we're going for the best ending, boys. We nailed that. Are you kidding me? A few days later, Joe and Amanda are visiting tonight. It's been a while since we saw them. Work's been getting in the way. Joe used to be my roommate. It's weird how late night parties and hangover pizza changed into dinner dates with the girlfriends. It's still nice though, Amanda, and Amanda's awesome. Alice likes her as well. I hope seeing them will make her feel better. Give her something else to think about. Whatever it is, that's been upsetting her. I managed to get some stuff out of her last night, but still. Maybe I should check it online. Check what, really? I thought we did... I don't know. Hmm. Good idea. There's no harm in Googling stuff, right? Maybe she's sick or something. No, we know what's wrong. She worried about her weight, boy. Hey, buddy. Her magazines. Da -da. I remember haggling over this painting at some farmer's market. Well, I guess we'll just go Google. Give it a go, Google. Is there anything that I'm missing interacting with right now? I guess not. Alright, let's give her an old Google. I went the wrong way. God dang it. I keep forgetting that the light part at the bottom is how to get to the living room. Okay, I guess I'll try searching for her symptoms. Bro, we already know what's wrong with her. Not eating. Uh, vomiting. None of these other ones seem true. Tiredness. Bulimia. I think that's what she has, honestly. Bulimia. Worrying about putting on weight, forcing yourself to throw up. Hmm. Bulimia? But she's not eating a lot. And Alice looks beautiful as she is. Why would she worry about her looks? You know she was talking about her friend coming back from the trip looking all gorgeous and shit. She did say she's been feeling self-conscious. And she's been having mood swings as well lately. As well, that's for sure. All the symptoms match. Could Alice really have bulimia? I need to keep an eye on her. And try not to upset her even more. Morning. Oh, hey. I thought you were working today. I called in sick. What? Why? I just... I didn't feel too well. What's going on? What's wrong? Nothing. I'm just... I don't know. I just didn't want to go in. I needed a break. Oh, right. So you're not sick or anything? No, I'm fine. What are you up to? This is weird. Well, it's not unusual for her to take a day off to chill every now and then, but... She just didn't mention anything last night. Anyway, should I tell her what I'm reading about? Don't tell her! I feel like we shouldn't tell her. Even though I know it's... Oh, baby. That's a hard one. I feel like we shouldn't. Screw it. Screw it. Honesty is the best policy. Uh, I'm ruining everything right here. Alright, guys. Um, so... Are you bulimic? <laughs> I did some reading. Reading? I know we talked yesterday, but I wanted to understand you better. I was trying to find out more. Babe. I know you're worried about your looks and putting on weight. I guess it's some kind of eating disorder, right? I... I didn't think of that. Oh, I'm making her cry. God damn it. Oh, Lord. Whatever it is, it seems serious. But it's kind of hard to understand understand for me because you're perfect. The thank you. But I really don't feel that way. I know. I just hate how I look and I'm stressed out about it. And I'll eat a lot because I'm stressed out and then I'll feel guilty about it. And then I'll try to get rid of it. But then I'm hungry. I just... I just think about it all the time. Baby, I don't know what to say. We'll figure it out. Can't really imagine how she's feeling right now, but the look on her face makes it clear. She needs me. I'm the freaking- Oh, we're killing this dog! She's in a scary place right now, and she won't get through it on her own. We'll figure it out, babe. I'm on your side, and we'll walk this path together, okay? Just talk to me. Whatever is on your mind, just talk to me. Let's let it all out. 
Oh wait, I didn't read. Log. Talk to me, let it all out. Whatever it, whenever it comes. Okay. We can always go on a diet if you want. But a healthy one, not starving yourself. If that helps. And I can help you find a therapist or some support group to talk to. We'll get through it, okay? The thank you. Seems much happier now. Maybe there is a chance. Maybe I'm the best boyfriend ever to somebody that's <laughs> had a random freaking video game chick. Alright. We're supposed to be meeting with Joe and Amanda tonight. We always love their company, so our dinner together might be a good distraction. On the other hand, I don't want to add to her stress. After this talk, it might be hard for Al to act normal around people, especially around food. Maybe I should offer to cancel our date. She wouldn't even ask for that on her own, knowing Joe is my best friend. I think we should cancel it. Yeah, I think we should. Cancel. Hey, do you want a Netflix and chill achievement? Let's freaking go. There's achievements in this game? I didn't even know, dog. Look at us. Look at us. We got a good achievement. Hey, do you want to cancel Joe and Amanda tonight? What? Why? I don't want to put any more pressure on you. It's been a tough couple of days. But you've been looking forward to it. I know, but I don't mind. I'd rather make sure you're feeling okay. Uh, well, if you don't mind then, I'd appreciate that. I'll call him then, and we can spend this evening in bed watching movies. Sounds great. Thank you. Right. I feel like this was a good decision. I hope Joe won't mind. I should call him now. Doesn't matter. Oh, well, whatever. Phone call. What's up, Joe? We ain't coming. Hello? Hey, man. How are you? Good. Excited to see you guys later. It's been a while. Yeah, it has. Um, listen, I... Uh-oh. Bad news? Yeah, I guess you could say so. I'm all ears. Us has been feeling rough lately. I'm not sure what's really sure what's going on. What do you mean? She's like, I don't know, depressed. She's so distant. What the hell are we talking about here? What? What? We know what's wrong. And she what? She's so distant and then snaps at me for no reason. Just to get really emotional afterwards. I think she's not telling me something. That was like every other woman. Ha! Huh. Just kidding, man. I know you're worried. It sounds like you should be. We'll see you some other time then. Yeah, seems like you guys need some time together. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Don't sweat it. I hope she'll get better soon. See ya. Bye. Man, we just totally threw her under the fucking bus, didn't we? I knew he'd understand. He's been my best friend for years now. I wish we could hang out with them, but Alice's well -be Alice's well-being comes first. Speaking of which, I should go to the shop and pick up some stuff for this evening. Alright, let's go. Go time. Watching movies tonight, I should get some snacks. Should I? She's been worried about food, maybe I shouldn't buy anything. I could just get some nice wine instead. But we're going to take a couple of hours, we'll definitely get hungry. We need to get something healthy, dude. I guess I could also pick up some healthy snacks, fruits and stuff. But what if that triggers her as well? Ugh, what should I do? Healthy snacks. I think I'll pick up some healthy snacks. I'd rather eat that than order pizza when we're starving in the middle of the night. She likes mango. I'll see if they have that. What are you talking about, dude? We, it's like we, we've we been talking about things we're going to do and he just forgets about it. Like, this dude has amnesia. Like, we literally just told her we were going to put her on a healthy diet and he's like, Maybe we should just drink wine tonight. <laughs> God dang. Alright, I think I have everything for the evening. I'll do some work before we st out before we start. Horror comedy. Horror. What? What do you want to watch? Oh. I'm a horror man, you know? Let's watch something scary then. Okay, I know just the right thing to watch. I've been waiting to see it forever. Great, I'll get the snacks and be right with you. Can't wait. We're the best, dude. No, we're not. Don't even look at the code. We're going in there to watch a movie. Don't even think about it. Grab the mangoes. Oh, Dante. I didn't see you there. Okay, I don't think he has anything to say to me. Sneaky beaky boy. Okay. To the bedroom. 
I need to prepare some snacks for but how do we prepare some what? We have mangoes. How do people eat mangoes? Get the knife, I guess. Hmm, so good. She'll love it. Dante! <laughs> oh wait, wrong way. Whoops. Alright, now we're ready. I'm ready. Great, what do you have there? I bought you some mango and other help some other healthy things. Aw, oh, thank you, I love mango. Good, so what are we watching? Oh, it seems so good. It's about this cult back in the 80s and... A few hours later. Oh man, I'm sleepy. Me too, it's just after 2 a.m. It's been a while since we watched so many movies. Yeah, it was so fun, baby. What? Thank you. My pleasure. Glad to see you smiling and relaxed. Let's get ready for bed, shall we? Good call. What my phone just say? We're, oh, we're just doing amazing. Oh, Dante! <laughs> Having a great time. This is going phenomenally. I have a better idea of what she's going through now. I'm still not sure if it's bulimia, though. I mean, aren't most women worried about their looks? I always thought bulimia is more dramatic. It seems like it's really affecting her, so I don't want to discard it, whatever it is. I need to support her and make sure she's okay. I don't really know what else I can do, but I feel like canceling Joe and Amanda was a good decision. It brought us closer together, and she seemed more relaxed. I think I needed it, too. Boom. Diary accomplished. Can you get some orange juice, too? Oh, Fudge! Well, we forgot to get the orange juice. We suck. Sorry. I'm sorry! The next morning. Oh. oh I had such a good sleep. Staying in and recharging with good movies was magical. Alice is still asleep. She looks so peaceful. I wish she could just stay like this, serene, not having to deal with any of those thoughts. The past couple of days have been really tough on her. And I can't even tell when it all started. I honestly don't know what to do to help her. I wish I could just take it all away and make her see herself the way she really is. I guess we'll take it day by day. Ugh, I don't want to get, leave bed yet. Let's go check social media. Oh wait, Insta books on my phone actually, ain't it? Amanda Jones. Oh, Amanda. Romantic date with my other half. Seems like they had a good night, too. I kind of wish we met up with them. We had fun last night, but I haven't seen Joe in ages. I'll need to plan something with them again at some point. Hey. Hey, beautiful. Did you sleep well? Yes, it was so nice. What you doing? Just on social media. Man and Joe added some pics. Oh, yeah? Oh, she lost weight. Oh, we're triggering her again. Hmm. Don't you think? Like, she looks so much better now. <laughs> Why do you care? Ah. He kind of looks the same. I feel like this is the one to actually approach your condition, but this one is probably a better answer. We know why she cares so much, because she's kind of looks the same. Um, she kind of looks the same. Don't you think she is attractive? She's pretty, yeah, but I can't really tell if she's lost or gained weight. I don't really care about those things, you know? You were literally just scrolling through her pictures. What? Where is that coming from? Nowhere. It just seemed weird. Seriously, she just popped up on my feed. I didn't go staring at her pics on purpose. And is it weird that I'm not really checking out other girls? Okay, okay. I'm just saying she's clearly changed. It's weird you didn't you wouldn't notice that. Maybe it's weird that you paid so much attention to it. I'm going to sh go. Sh I'm going to shower. I'm meeting Chloe for coffee today. Okay. What the hell was that? How did it escalate so quickly? Because we didn't go on the offensive. I messed up. I should have been like, why do you care so much? I know she's struggling, but she seems absolutely fine just 10 minutes ago. It's like I'm riding a roller coaster with her. Uh, I should go for a walk or something. I need to clear my head and get out of the house. I'll just change and go. 
Alice is taking a shower now. Should we? Right, I'm ready. I hope a walk will make me feel better. Where's Dante at? Where you at, Dante? Hey! Okay. I hope some time together would make things better between us, but she just jumped back into it again. It's like we can't have a normal conversation. Everything just ends with the argument or crying. How do we go back from this? Some time later. Maybe we should start working out together. She's so obsessed with looks and food. This could be good. I see so many couples running together in the park. They seem so happy. I guess it would be good for both of us. I'm arriving tomorrow just before 5 p.m. so we can meet for dinner. Around that time. Love you. What? Oh, I completely forgot my mom was coming. We were supposed to meet her for dinner tomorrow. All this stuff with Alice was the only thing on my mind. I wonder if I should remind Alice about it. Not sure if she'll want to go out anymore. Reminder. We planned it a while ago, so I shouldn't just go on my own. I also don't want my mom to worry. If I come on my own, she might, she'll might she start asking questions and won't stop until I tell her everything. I'll just remind Alice about it later. Some time later. So much calmer now. I think Alice has gone out to meet Chloe. I'll use this time to get some work done. A few hours later. Hello. Oh, hi. How was it? Um, I didn't meet with her. Oh, why? Where did you go then? I went to the mall to meet her, but then I just... I didn't really want to see anyone, so I just canceled. Really, what happened? Are you okay? Yeah. I just, I don't know. I thought about how I'd have to pretend everything is okay, and I guess I just didn't want to go through that. Baby, I'm sorry I snapped at you this morning. It's fine as long as it's better now. I know you're really trying for me, and I do appreciate that. I know, I'm sorry it's hard on you too. Aw, uh, it's okay, babe. I'm here for you. Let's just take it one step at a time. Maybe I should mention we could be working out together. Although, I'm not sure if it's the best time for that. We could start working out. You know I went to the park today. Yeah? I saw some couples running together and I thought about us. Maybe we should start working out too. It would be healthy for both of us, I guess. We could motivate each other as well. Hmm. Don't feel pressured or anything. I just thought it could be a good idea. I think that would be nice. Thank you for suggesting it. Great. Anyway, I'm gonna go cook something for us. I'll call you when it's ready. Okay, thanks. In the evening. I'm tired. I think it's time to call it a day. Dante! <laughs> Let me check my phone. Because I missed the orange juice thing somehow. Okay, nothing. Oh, god dang it. Sorry, Dante. You going to sleep? Yeah, I'm just gonna brush my teeth. Why? Just asking. I just, I miss you today. Me too, I'll be right with you. Okay. Seems calmer now. Hope she feels better. I'll join her in a minute. Toothbrush time. It's been a long day. I was really worried this morning. We had a nice dinner after we came back home. And it seems she's calmed down now. All clean. I should go to bed now. It'd be tragic if she was like freaking doing something wild in the other room. Seems calmer now. Babe? Yeah? My mom messaged me about dinner tomorrow. Oh yeah, it's tomorrow. What time does she want to meet? She says she arrives at 5, so sometime after that. Alright, I'll join you after work then. Just let me know when you where you are. You sure you want to go? Of course, why? Well, you've been canceling some other meetings. Um, yeah, I know. I just didn't feel like meeting Chloe today. But come on, it's your mom. This one's important. Okay, I'm ha very happy to hear that. So you're feeling better now? Yeah. Come here, let me cuddle you. Remember, we used to spend days like this all the time. It's so all day and long in bed. Yeah, it feels like a different lifetime. Yeah, life's gotten more hectic now. I don't want to lose that part of us, you know? I know, me neither. I just wish I could help you feel better somehow. 
You always do. Come here. What if I look at my phone while we're talking? <laughs> uh. Oh, I actually don't remember the last time she kissed me. I missed this. I want to feel closer. her closer now. Oh, she just tensed up? Is everything okay? Yeah, um, I don't really know why. Do you want me to stop? I think so. What? Okay. I'm just, I'm not really feeling it. But it's been ages! <laughs> That's fine, I'm sorry. That's fine, babe, baby, I'm sorry. I'll stop, I got carried away. I only wanted to make you feel good. If you're not feeling it, then that's fine. I'm sorry. Don't apologize, baby. You don't owe me anything. Can I still cuddle you? Of course. It's just that I have not been feeling very confident recently. So I don't really want to be touched. I can't believe such a beautiful person can feel so bad about herself. I wish I could do something to change how she sees her body. I understand. I'm not going to push. You're beautiful, though. I know you can't see it, but you but you are. Thank you. I'll keep reminding you of that for as long as I can. I said it before, but roller coaster is the only way to describe our relationship recently. Last night was great. Then this morning she snapped at me. Then she apologized and everything was fine again. Until I wasn't until it wasn't anymore. I can't touch her because she doesn't want it. Whatever I say can end up triggering her. How do we get through this? Oh, long time no update. Everything okay with the project? I guess, man. Get off me. <laughs> I don't know if we'll play through this multiple times, though, because I'm... We might. Might try to get all the achievements, at least. The next morning. Hmm. I'm tired. I didn't sleep well. I was getting ready for work. Morning. Hey. Doesn't seem like she wants to talk. You okay? Yeah. I'm just trying to find some clothes. Nothing fits me anymore. But... But what? I don't know. You look great, just like always. Uh, you're not helping. Bet if I agreed with her, she would have gone ballistic. <sighs> I'm clearly not good at this. I'm going back to sleep. A few hours later. Ugh. Don't feel like getting up. I wish I could just go back to sleep. We're not in a good place. I felt so off earlier before she went to work. Usually she's chatty when she's getting ready and now she barely even talked. I don't really know how to approach her. She's completely in her head lately and everything I do seems wrong. There was no usual morning kiss, not even a smile. We really need to talk tonight. Uh, I need to get up and eat something. Well, well, well. Let's check our phone. We should probably tell George about our project so we don't get fired or something. Whatever. We should brush our teeth. It's early in the morning. Okay, we're not brushing our teeth. What's in the toilet? Nothing. Okay. How do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? It's too early to shower now. What, you don't shower in the morning, dog? Dante, breakfast time. Hmm, Dante, what about your breakfast? Did Alice not feed him? That's strange, she always does it. I mean, it's her beloved cat, she always takes care of him. Maybe she forgot. She was quite stressed out this morning. Well, I'll just feed him myself. Hey, Dante. There you go. Bon appetit, my little dude. Now on to my breakfast. Hmm, I got a message. Dun, dun, dun. About the dinner with your mom, I won't be able to make it. Sorry, XX. From Alice. Can't make it. She knows how important it is, and she just canceled like that? Ah. This is ridiculous. Let's just say she must have her reasons. I want to say this is ridiculous, so... <laughs> she must have a reason to do something like that. Maybe something happened. I'm not going to pressure her to do something if she's not up for it. I'll just go on my own. I'll just get on with the stuff for now. A few hours later. All right, I think it's time to meet my mom. Check our photos that we got. Dante! With the dead mouse. 
Oh, we got all the pictures, but two. We're killing it. Hello, my dear. Hey, Mom. How are you? How was your flight? I'm good, love. Thank you. I'm still not used to flying, however. I was very glad when we landed. Oh no, I hope you're okay. Nothing to worry about, my dear. And how are you? You look tired. Ah, uh, yeah, I've been busy. You always say that, just like your dad. Should we order something, then you can- Oh, should we order something, then you can tell me all about it? Oh yes, I'm starving. Duh. So yeah, I guess we will be signing the contract, and that will uh, cover a couple months at least. But things are going well and steady. I'm glad to hear that, my dear. I'm so very proud of you. Thanks, Mom. I must admit, I was worried about your future when you quit your job. Yeah, I was worried too, but I had to give it a go. Yes, and I'm happy I was wrong. Now tell me what's bothering you. What? Do not think you can fool me. I can tell when something is wrong. You can tell, talk all you want about the good things, but I know you're keeping something to yourself. Uh, I don't know. Hmm? I mean, of course I know, but... You know you can talk to me, love. Is it something to do with Alice? How do you know that? You haven't talk, really talked about her. And she Usually she's the main thing on your mind. Has something happened? <sighs> yeah, I guess you could say so. What is it, my dear? Well, I think she's struggling with some eating disorder, bulimia or something like that. Oh no, are you sure? Yeah, she's been very dis distant and weird lately, recently. Then I heard her throwing up after dinner once. And ever since then, things have been getting worse. Did you talk about it? Yeah, a few times, but she's so difficult to talk to. It feels like everything I do ends up being somehow wrong. You know these things are very serious. Yeah. She needs to get professional help before it gets worse. You th do you think? Yes, love. This is not something you can help her with on your own. And be patient with her. She's not really herself for now. Definitely isn't. But remember that you can't live her life for her. What do you mean? This is her issue after all. You won't be able to take it away from her or solve it yourself. She needs to do it herself. You start doing it, you might hurt, hurt her even more down the line. You mean she'd become too dependent on me? Yes, exactly. Gotcha. I guess I'll try to talk to her, talk to her about finding a therapist. I think that would be for the best. I hope she gets better. I am very fond of her. Me too. You have been going through a lot together, love. Don't forget that when things get difficult. Yeah, I'm trying. I really wish this never happened, you know? I know, dear, but remember, situations like this make for a good test. I'm saying this just in case. I think you're both great for each other. I thought we were too. I know it's difficult, love, but you have to stay strong. I believe in you both. Thanks, Mom. Ooh. Talking to Mom made me realize some things. We really do need to talk when Alice is back. Gone too far. I'm putting my foot down. Hey. What's wrong? Hey, what's wrong? Nothing. I'm just tired. That's not everything, though, is it? What do you mean? You know what I mean, babe. I think we should talk. Oh, okay. You know it's not been great. Why did you cancel today? Because, because I didn't fill up for it. But yesterday you were confident, so confident you wanted to go. What changed? I, I don't know. I just didn't feel like going. You can't do that. You can't keep changing your mind like that. How are we supposed to plan anything? I canceled Joe and Amanda for you. I thought we could at least see my mom. Why are you bringing that up? It was you who suggested canceling them. Yeah, but I did it for you. Just wanted our normal life back. I know you're going through a tough period, but you're taking it out on me too. Like with Amanda. You had to go at me because you were jealous. You had no reason to be. I've never given any you any reason to be jealous. I know. Why are you so worried now? I don't know, I... I just thought she looked great and got so insecure about myself. 
But then I was wondering why you're even with me, and... That's enough talk and thinking like this, babe. We've been together for so long now. Some girl looking better than you, she used to doesn't change anything between us. I'm only looking at you anyway. Thank you for saying that. I think I just get stuck in my head sometimes. You do. Especially recently. It feels like you're avoiding me all the time. It's not that. Then what is it? We barely talk now. If we do, we argue and cry. You're constantly in your head. You don't really pay attention to me anymore. You don't even want to touch me. You don't even want to touch me anymore. You're so cold and distant and... I'm not even about sex. I just miss being close. I just want to hug you and kiss you. What am I doing wrong? Tell me. You're not doing anything wrong, I swear. I'm just so scared. Of what? Of how I look. Of you rejecting me. Why would I reject you? You're perfect. I love every single inch of you. Whatever you're thinking, it's all in your head. Nothing's changed in mine. I know it doesn't make sense. I sometimes don't get it either, but I just can't. You're not doing anything wrong, I swear. Trust me, it's not your fault. I know you've had it tough. I understand that. You need help. You need help, babe. You really do. And I don't mean it in a bad way. I want you to get better and you deserve the best help. Someone who understands this stuff. Do you really think so? I do. You can't keep going on like this. We can't keep going like this. It's ruining everything. I haven't seen you happy in ages. You're right. My god, you're right. What's happened to me? I'm a monster. I don't want to live like this anymore. I'm just so tired. I know you are, baby. I just feel guilty all the time. Whenever I eat, it's too much. I just keep comparing myself to everyone. I just hate myself and how I look. Hopefully you'll see, soon see how beautiful you are. We'll get there. Thank you. I actually dated a chick that had bulimia. And this is, this is super realistic, but I did not handle it as well as this dude did, I don't think. I think his mom gave some pretty crucial advice that you have to be a little bit more stern with him and then just trying to be like, oh, we can work through this together kind of shit. I often go back to the day when we decided to take control of her issues. I'm so glad I suggested finding a therapist back then. Even though the first two weren't great, we finally managed to... And some people just don't want to help too, so that's the main reason it didn't work out. She was until that wasn't going. <laughs> Tragic. We finally managed to find some someone really good for her. She's been getting better, and even though we still have some issues and she still gets triggered with, by some things, I know we can deal with all of it. I can understand how we're better now. We both know we're trying really hard for each other, and that's what matters. Even if we argue and even if we cry, I feel like we've grown so much closer because of it. It's so good to see her happy, happier now. See her eat more normally and be more healthy. I hope one day she'll be able to live completely guilt-free. Well, we got 10 achievements. Or 2 achievements, sorry. So then I got to... We're gonna get all the achievements, I think. I don't know if we're gonna get... Ah, uh, god dang it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do the best we can. <laughs> Alright, what do I do now? Is that the end of the game? The end! I think that was a good end. Alright guys, um, while the credits are scrolling, I guess we'll try to get the other ends. I'm only going to read the parts that are different. If anything's the same, I'm just going to skip over it so we can get through this qu kind of quickly and try to get to the other endings. But yeah, uh, it's a very good game. It's super realistic for somebody with bulimia. That's kind of how the relationship goes, or at least from my experience as well. That was pretty relatable. Do, 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 do. Thank you for playing Gill Free. It's a cool game, though. I enjoyed it. A lot of reading, though. Alright, let's go. Okay, we did that part already. Yep, skip to the next answer choice. That's how we do. Oh, now I gotta do the thing. Got you. There's some hidden achievements, so I don't know if we'll actually get all the achievements, to be honest with you. Leave her be. I'm pretty sure she's throwing up. Was it the food? Barely touched it, though. Maybe it was something she ate before. Some kind of stomach flu, but she said it was fine. I'll just leave her be. She clearly didn't want to talk anymore. Okay. 
Well, we nailed that. Ah, Beton. I want to write about what happened before I go to sleep. I'm worried about Alice. She's been quite distant. This is the same thing I wrote the first time, so this didn't really change. Alright. Next morning. Yawn. Boom. I'm ill fit for the king. Boo -doo 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 -doo. Ah, see, I didn't even notice that she hadn't been eating the breakfast the first time, like I did the first time. Do do do. Let's get working. Crack into that work, boy. I think we got like the best ending on the first try, though, with the uh, finding out it was bulimia and whatnot. Probably should have got our orange juice, though. I really did mess up on that one. What was I supposed to do? I'm supposed to do something, but I can't remember what it was. What were you we doing? Let's see. I was supposed to be doing something. Let's look at the... Oh, I was supposed to get the pin from her bag. That's what we were doing. Got it. Got it. God dang it. I always forget. This is all tragic. There we go. A few hours later. And then we're gonna make dinner. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, I was just gonna click the stove. That's what we do. So far, she's saying the same thing. Yeah, same thing. Nothing's changed yet. Even though I'm like totally neglecting her, unlike the other day. I think it's actually just leaving things out. Where did she go? Where did you go? Where we spent what? Uh, how did I get out of here? Ah, god dang it! So bad at that. What's up? Hey, babe. Yeah. Are you feeling okay? Yeah. What's wrong? Well, that's what I wanted to ask. You seemed upset last night. Something bothering you? Well, what do you mean? I mean, you've been kind of distant lately, blah, 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 blah. This is all the same. You're probably right. What is it? You know you can tell me. No, I know. It's just, um, I don't know. I've not been feeling myself recently. I don't know what to tell you. Is this something with work? No, it's nothing. It's... I don't think there's any specific reason, you know? I feel like she's hiding something, but if... Maybe I should just let it go, or maybe I need a different angle. I'm here for you. I guess a cuddle and some support is all I can do for now. She seems overwhelmed with whatever is on her mind. I'm really worried about her. After acting strange yesterday, she seemed, came back from work today all happy like nothing happened. That's good, of course, but how do you go from throwing up and being so cold to getting all excited about a sandwich? Then she started being evasive when I asked her if, I, if everything is fine. I could tell her she was hiding something, but I didn't manage to get anything out of her. Maybe I should have pushed her more. I don't know if I'm going to get all the endings, actually. <laughs> kind of debated, because I feel like it's going to take a while, and I already got the best ending, so I feel like all these other endings are going to kind of suck. Joe and Amanda are visiting. It's been a while since we saw them. Work's been getting in the way. Joe used to be my roommate. It's weird how late night parties and hangover pizza change into dinner dates. Still the same. Maybe I should check it online. Check what, really? I wouldn't even know where to start. Feels like a weird phase. I will just try to be good to her and hopefully it will all pass. I'm taking the completely not caring. Morning. Oh, hey. I thought you were working today. I called in sick. What? Why? 
She's already calling in sick. She's getting a freaking leap on it. I just, I didn't feel too well. What's going on? What's wrong? Nothing. I'm just, I don't know. I just didn't want to go in. I need a break. Oh, right. So you're not sick or anything? No, I'm fine. Do you want some coffee? Always. It's weird. Well, it's not unusual for her to take her day off to chill every now and then, but... You didn't mention anything last night. You know Jam Joe and Amanda are coming today, right? Of course I do. Oh, I just thought, you know. If you're not feeling good, maybe you... I told you, I'm fine. Right. We're killing it. What time are they coming again? I think he said around 6. Okay, we should get started on cleaning up then. Yes, boss. And actually decide what we're making for dinner. Rizzo. Something that's not risotto. I'm out. <laughs> you can call Joe and tell him that then. Tell him that you're abusing your position of power? Gladly. I'm sure Amanda won't let him do anything about it. Shoot, you're right. There's no hope. Yup, anyway. I found this new roasted veg bake, which looks incredibly impressive. Oh yeah? Sounds good. Do you want to make it today? I'd like to, but I'm not sure if they're going to like it. Usually we go with something like pizza. Oh yeah, Joe loves pizza. He never shuts up about it. Yeah, I think they'll be expecting that. Pizza's always good, but it's not sure it's a safe choice for her. I wouldn't want her to feel bad about eating it, but then at least everyone else would be happy. Maybe she wouldn't care too much, care that much with, with, when with people. It's a special occasion after all. Seems cool about it anyway. What should we go with? Roasted vegetables. I think that roasted vegetables sound great, babe. Let's try it out. Are you sure? What if? The, but what if they don't like it? Well, then they can host the next dinner and we won't have any cleaning to do. But why wouldn't they like it? It sounds good and you're awesome, an awesome cook, so bring it on. Okay, I'll make a shopping list then. I'm not sure if I'm reading too much into it now or if she was really stressed about the food. She barely ever cared so much about what we'd eat. Usually we'd just go with something quick and easy. Or maybe I just didn't notice anything. There's nothing wrong with wanting a healthier meal. But if it's causing her distress, I hope there's no reason for it. I made the list, added a few bit of things, to, a few bits for the rest of the week as well. Okay, sounds good. We're exactly what kind of stuff to buy. Make sure you try to get it, okay? Um, yeah, so of course. Let's see. Let me see. Skimmed milk, low fat cheese. Are we on a diet? What? No, it's just, I just want us to eat a bit more healthy. That's fair enough, but it's not like we eat unhealthy. Yeah, okay. Oh, and for your sauce, make sure you get exactly this brand I wrote down. It's much better. Uh, I feel like I'm destined to fail this. Maybe I should just ask her to do it herself, and I won't. And I will clean the house in the meantime. At least she could buy everything she wants. But it sounds like she's quite stressed already. Maybe I should just do it. What should I do? This has a lot more choices. Do the shopping. Babe, I'm a big boy. I can do the shopping. I know you can. I just want to make sure you get the right things. It will be front. Don't stress. I'll get you all the perfect things. Okay, I'll start cleaning the house then. Okay, yeah, room me if you remember some anything else. Do do do. I came to the biggest store in the neighborhood, but they don't have everything she wanted. I think it should be fine if I just get some substitutes. It shouldn't matter that much in the end. Wrong! Wrong! I'm back. Hey, did you get everything? More or less, yeah. Great, I'll start cooking then. Uh oh. I thought I told you to get low fat cheese. Um, they didn't have it. You could have went, gone to a different shop. Yeah, but just for one thing, this one's perfectly fine. It doesn't matter. But it does. Oh. Uh, whatever. I'm going to start cooking. You need help? No, thank you. What the hell? Oh, what did, what did just happen? You snapped at me because of something like that? And why is she suddenly so angry? She was fine when I was leaving. Maybe I should have gone to a p different store to pick up exactly what she wanted. How was I supposed to know she would flip out like that, though? Anyway, I'll stay out of her way for now. Let her cool down. Ding dong! Oh, it must be them. I'll go open the door. Dun dun dun. What's up, girl? Cooking. I won't bother. Dante! Oh crap. What's up? Hello. Hey man, long time no see. Hi. 
How are you guys? Come in, come in. We're good. Very excited about this bottle of amazing wine I haggled over for what seemed like years. We went to this market and they had all sorts of nice alcohols. You have to try this wine, man. It's good. Good enough to pay full price and walk with your pride untouched. No way. It's going to taste better now. The effort I put into it. Man, you sound like a caveman hunting for food. I see no difference. Excuse me? Speaking of food, the house smells amazing. Ah, oh, yeah. Alice outdid herself again. Wait till you try it. Can't wait. I'm starving. Let's go say hi to her. Bon appetit. Aha! Now I'm just missing one picture. Oh, Alice, this looks amazing. I hope it tastes amazing. You made it, I'm sure, so I'm sure it does. Let's try it. So good. Glad you guys like it, enjoy. Uh, I think we should swap partners. I want Alice for my wife. No way. I'll take the amazing chef and you can have the cheap caveman. Why, thank you. I'm offended. I mean, this wine is good, so... Oh, take that, woman. We would be just fine. Living on alcohol and fast food? What's wrong with that? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we spent about three years living like that. Ah, <laughs> those were the times. There we go, another trip down memory lane. You guys are getting old. It wasn't really that long ago. It's just that the lot has changed. For the better. Here's to that. Yay! You've been very quiet, Alice. Ah, uh, sorry. I must have spaced out a bit. Alice is a freaking Amazon, bro. <laughs> Look how short she is. <laughs> Maybe the wine hit her already. <laughs> anyway, this food is calling me. I need more. Oh, can I have some more too? Of course, help yourself. So good. Are you not eating? Oh, I'm not very hungry. I ate too much when I was making it. Man is right. I just noticed she's barely touched it. I hope she's not worrying again. She made what she wanted after all. I thought she would be the one digging into it. Something's on her mind, that's for sure. I hope she'll manage to relax tonight. We had too much wine. After finishing Joe's... Oh, I'm <laughs> drunk. Joe's bottle. Amanda sent us to get more, and so we did. We talked about Alice on the way, and I told Joe everything. It was good to talk about it with someone. When we came back, Amanda was very happy. Everyone was happy. I think even Alice was happy. Although she barely ate anything for all night, only a bit later when she started getting dr drunker. The rest of the night was so much fun. We played some games and danced a bit. Later in bed, she cuddled up to me. Maybe there was nothing to worry about. I don't know what now. I know my head hurts. I should drink water before I go to sleep. True. All right. Yeah, I don't know. Next morning. My God, the thirst, the headache. I hate wine. Alice is still asleep. Good for her. I need some water in a shower in that order. Water. Ah, oh, I'm alive. Not sure what it was in that wine, but let's just say never again. I hope Alice feels better than me. She didn't eat much yesterday. Amanda was right to notice, but she barely touched it. Alice's cooking was good, though, so we were all just stuffing our faces. She really might be struggling with something, but later during the night, she seemed really happy. I guess the alcohol helped her relax. Anyway, time for a shower. I need to wash off my headache. Shower time, baby. Oh my god, it's a cute little kitty cat. Wait, let's go back. Gotta talk to the cat. And his mouse. Hey, buddy. Okay. Back to the game. Dun, dun, dun. Shower time. Ugh, my stomach feels so heavy after all that drinking. It's hard to even walk, and I feel sick. Hmm, I think I put on some weight recently. That's not surprising, really. Working from home, not moving at all. Oh well, guess I have to stop with the snacks and get more active. Hmm, I wonder what Alice thinks when she's looking at herself. She has such an amazing body, it's hard to imagine she's insecure. I could look for her, look at her for hours. 
and she can't even see how beautiful she is. Even if, why would being super thin bother you so much? She wouldn't get so down on her. She shouldn't get so down on herself. I guess I just don't understand her. Eh, I need a shower. Overthinking won't help. The game keeps hinting that she has bulimia. I know she has bulimia. I've already beat it. God dang it. It's so much better. Oh, or not? My head's still spinning a bit. I should actually go for a run. It's supposed to help with feeling rough. A few years back, I would have drank the hangover away. Man, I'm getting old. Anyway, I'll get, go get changed. Some fresh air, fresh air will do me good. We should go running together, maybe. Oh, how do I get out of here again? There we go. Yo, girl. You must be tired after last night. Get your ass up. Whoa, I look fit in this. Although, I, last time I wore these short, they weren't this tight. Oh, well, never mind. It's one more reason to go, I guess. I hope I'm not going to regret this. Take her with you. Oh, crap. All right, let's go jogging. I'll be back later, Dante. Let's do it. Sometime later. Ah, ah, hell yeah, that was awesome. I always forget how good I feel after exercise. Even though I walked half of it, I feel so much better. I deserve a nice breakfast. Where did you go? Morning. Oh, hey, you're up. How are you feeling? Don't even start. What was in that wine? Cocaine? That bad, huh? Yeah, my head is killing me. I made some coffee and breakfast. Help yourself. Great, thanks, babe. You go on a run? I did. It was. I was feeling rough, so I thought it wouldn't hurt. That was actually awesome. Didn't know I still had it in me. Oh, right. How did it go? Better than I thought, actually. I forgot how good exercising feels. I used to work out a lot, remember? I want to try and do it more often. Yeah, sounds good. Are you okay? Me? Of course. Spaced out a bit. Did I say, say something wrong? No, no, I just, it's the hangover, I guess. Oh, right, well, maybe we should start running together. Might help with the stress as well. Um, yeah, I guess so. Don't feel like you have to. I'm just pumped up right now. I'll think about it. Hmm, we used to work out together quite a bit. She's, why is she suddenly so weird about it? I mean, she could at least show some support. Maybe it's the hangover. Anyway, did you enjoy, enjoy last night? It was nice. Joe has put on a lot of weight, though. You used to look so good, and now... Ouch, I get what you mean, but it's not our business to judge, is it? I guess it's the stress at work. He does, did mention that they have a couple of big clients. I guess so. As long as Amanda's still happy with him, then that's all that matters. Yeah. You look great. I think she lost weight. Yeah, she looked hot. <laughs> yeah, she looked hot. <laughs> Tragic, bro. Yeah, she looked really good. I wonder if she's on a diet or something. Yeah, she changed a lot since college. Is that why you were flirting with her so much? Hang on a second. What? What are you talking about? Don't think I didn't notice. You were checking her out a lot. You're crazy. Why would I even do that? Because you think she's hot? She is. So what? I'm with you, and she's my best mate's wife. Think about what you're saying. <laughs> Whatever. I need a shower. I'm meeting Chloe for coffee today. Okay. What the hell happened to her? She's jealous of Amanda now? Amanda! Of all people, her? We've been all been good friends for years now. What the hell? We all had fun last night, but I didn't even think of flirting with her. We all acted like we normally do. Well, apart from Alice, what is going on with her? Anyway, there's no use thinking about it. I should do some work. Fun times. Alright. You talked me into it. Yeah, I'm picking the bad choices this time, so I can... Alright, what's up? I haven't been very productive lately. I feel like I'm falling behind. I need to get back into it. Fifteen minutes later. Ugh, I'm really not into the mood for this. My mind keeps running in circles. Half an hour later. Arr, I can't focus. I keep thinking about the past couple days. Something's going on. Has Alice always been interested in what other people look like? I can't even remember at this stage. I feel like we drifted apart. Even though we try to make things better, it's just not working. I kind of just want to talk to someone. Maybe I should call Joe. Oh, my phone's on this stupid thing. <laughs> Yo. Yo, Joe. Hello. Hi, man. How are you feeling? Oh, don't ask. Let's just say I'm still in bed. That bad, huh? 
Definitely worth it. We had mo so much fun. Me too. It was good to see you both. Yeah, and how was Alice? Um, I think she's hungover too. You think? I mean, she's not in the best mood, so I guess so. Oh crap, she's not feeling good? I don't know. What's wrong? She has been strange lately. Strange how? Strange, distant, strange, moody, strange? Moody? Don't you think it could be? No, no, it's definitely not that. Oh, but isn't that normal with girls? No, man, I mean a lot. It's all she thinks about, food, looks, all that stuff. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, Amanda did say she thought Alice seemed a bit different. Really? Yeah, it says she seemed nervous about something. Hmm. The past couple of days have been tough. I don't really know what to do. It's like we can't have a normal conversation anymore. Maybe you just give her time? You know, sometimes they just want to have some me time. You think? Well, that or do something nice together. You know, those are two completely different things. You may be right. How do I know which one to choose then? Maybe ask her. Ah, uh, you're not helpful at all. I'm a simple man. What do you expect? You could talk to Amanda about it. She'd probably be more helpful. No, it's fine. I don't want to bother you guys too much. Thanks for listening. Anyway, I'll have to think about it. Anytime. I hope you guys figure it out. Me too. Give her space or do something together, huh? Kind of want to spend quality time with her. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Maybe it would help with us with whatever this is. On the other hand, though, it, I'd rather avoid more arguments. Maybe I should actually give her some space. What should I do? Quality time. I don't like arguing for no reason, especially with her. It's all because of the stuff she's been going through. I need to be as supportive as I can. I think some calm quality time would be good for us. I'll talk to her later. For now, I just need to focus on work. Hey. Oh, hey, I thought you were meeting Clint with Chloe today. Yeah, I canceled it. Really? You're not feeling up to it? Not really. I just want to stay home. Oh. Hmm? Well, yeah? I know it's not been great between us lately. So I was thinking, do you want to spend quality time together, just the two of us? I'd love that. What do you want to do? I was thinking maybe we can go for a walk around the park. The weather is really nice today. Sounds lovely. Let's do that. Awesome. I'll go get changed then. Okay. Oh. Hey, we might get all the pictures. Photographer achievement. I keep forgetting we have this park so close to our house. Yay, we got all the pictures, boys. Wing set. Yeah, me too. I remember the day when I went on a run. Oh my god, my alarm clock. It's really nice. Babe? Hmm? Why did you get so upset this morning? Did I do something wrong? No, of course you didn't. I just... I guess I just been upset by some stupid things recently. Like what? Like, you know, Amanda looks so great. I just couldn't stop comparing myself to her. Oh. I didn't know. I wouldn't expect you to. But she literally looks the same. I think she lost some weight. So what? You're still the hottest person in the room. Uh, thank you for saying that. I just get it stuck in my head sometimes, I guess. Hmm. And then when you went on a run, I just thought about how unfit I am. Maybe. I know I should be happy for you, but I just kept thinking that it's me who should be running. I guess I just felt kind of jealous and guilty. We could work out together. I don't want to get the back. Oh boy, I feel like I should. Oh, we're gonna do the bad ending this time. I won't be talking about it then. I wouldn't ever imagine that me going on a run would make her feel bad. I clearly still don't understand this whole thing very well. If it triggers you, I'm gonna talk about this stuff. I didn't realize it affected you so much. No, no, it's okay. I don't want you to feel like you can't talk to me. Honestly, babe, it's fine. I'd rather keep the details to myself than make you feel bad. Not a big deal anyway. It's not like I'm some kind of fitness freak. Okay. Thank you. And sorry. It's okay, don't worry about it. Oh. Is that my mom? Yeah, it's mom. What? Oh. 
completely forgot my mom was coming. We were supposed to meet her for dinner tomorrow. All this stuff with Alice was on the only thing on my mind. Everything okay? My mom messaged. Oh yeah, she's coming back tomorrow. What time did she want to meet? She said she arrives at 5, so sometime after that. Alright, I'll join you after work then. Just let me know when to, where you are. You sure you want to go? Of course, why? Well, you've been canceling all, some other meetings. Uh, yeah, I know. I just didn't feel like meeting Chloe today. Come on, it's your mom. It's in, This one's important. Okay, I'm very happy to hear that. So you're feeling better now? Yeah. Sorry about this morning. I don't know what got into me. It's fine, as long as it's better now. It is. Thank you for being so patient. Of course. I understood her issues, but every day is a new lesson. I never would have thought that Alice compares herself to others so much. I always thought that she was quite confident, actually. And then there's this thing with working out and feeling guilt. If I knew it would cause her so much distress, I would have stayed home. But at the same time, it's not great that I can't do something which is good for my health without making hers worse. Why does it have to be so difficult? I'm glad we went out in the evening. That talk was much needed. And I hope it'll make things easier between us. Alright. The next morning. Hmm. Tired. I didn't sleep well. Alice is getting ready for work. Morning. Hey. Doesn't seem like she wants to talk. You okay? Yeah. I'm just trying to find some clothes. Nothing fits me anymore. But. But what? I don't know. You just look great. Just like always. Ugh, oh, you're not helping. If I agreed with her, she's gone ballistic. Now I'm clearly not good at this. I'm going back to sleep. A few hours later. Ugh, I don't feel like getting up. I wish I could just go back to sleep. We're not in a good place. I felt so off earlier before she went to work. Usually she's chatty and when she's getting ready. And now, she barely even talked. I don't know what's going on with her. She's completely in her head lately. And everything I do seems wrong. There was no usual morning kiss, not even a smile. I already read this, god dang it. I don't know why I'm reading it again. Need to get ready for work. I think. Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Oh, it's too early to shower. Oh, maybe I'm just supposed to... Breakfast time. Hmm, Dante, what about your breakfast? Did Alice not feed him? This is the same. Oh, I got a message. Oh. Long time, no update. Screw you, George. Wow, she can't make it. That's ridiculous. She seems so unreliable. She's just doing whatever she wants. She doesn't even think about me. My mom comes around so rarely. I, she could at least make some effort for this. Ugh, I'm so pissed off. Fine, if she doesn't want to come with me, I'll go alone. I'll get on with stuff for now. Alright, I think it's time to leave now. We're gonna do our best to get all the endings, but this is a long game for <laughs> five endings. Hello, my dear. Hey, mom. How are you? How was your flight? Let's skip this. Oh, yeah, I guess we'll be signing the contract and that will co cover a couple months at least. So things are going well and steady. I'm glad to hear that, my dear. I'm very proud of you. Thanks, mom. I must admit, I was worried about about your future when you quit your job. Yeah, I was worried too, but I had to give it a go. Yes, and I'm happy I was wrong. Now tell me what's bothering you. Well, what? You don't think you can fool me. I can tell when something's wrong. You could talk to me about the good things, but I know you're keeping something to yourself. Eh, I don't know. Hmm? I mean, of course I know, but... You know you can talk to me, love. Is it something to do with Alice? How do you know that? You haven't really talked about her, and usually she's the main thing on your mind. Has something happened? Uh, yeah, I guess you could say so. What is it, dear? Well, all she's been thinking about is food and how she looks. And how others look. She compares herself a lot. Oh no, are you sure? Yeah, she's been very distant and weird lately. Then I hear her throwing up after dinner once, and ever since, she, things have gotten worse. Did you talk about it? Yeah, a few times, but she's so difficult to talk to. Feels like everything I do ends up being somehow wrong. You know, these things are serious. Yeah. She needs to get professional help before it gets worse, do you think? Yes, love. There's not something... Okay, this is the same. Alright. 
Probably mom made me realize some things. We really need to talk when Alice is back. It's gone too far. Hey. Hey, what's wrong? Nothing, I'm just tired. That's not everything, though, is it? What do you mean? You know what I mean, babe. I think we should talk. Oh, okay. You know, I, it's not been great. Why did you cancel today? Because, because I didn't feel up for it. But yesterday, you were so confident that you wanted to go. What changed so suddenly? I, I don't know. I just didn't feel like going. I can't rely on you recently. This is different. I can't rely on you recently. Da, da, da. You change your mind all the time. Cancel meeting with your friends too. Hell, you even started missing work. What's going on? I just want our normal life back. I know you're going through a tough period, but we're, you're taking it out on me too, like with Amanda. You had to go at me because you were jealous. That's too much. You can't just act like this, especially when I've given you no reason to be jealous. I know. It just feels like I can't even look at other people. Having friends is not a reason for concern, you know. I know that. I freaked out. I know it. I'm sorry. I just thought she looked great and got so insecure about myself. But then I was just wondering why you're even with me and that's this is crazy. We've been together for so long now. Why would you question it over such a silly thing? I'm only looking at you anyway. Thank you for saying that. I think I just get stuck in my head sometimes. Yeah, you do. Especially recently. Feels like you've been avoiding me all the time. It's not that. Then what is it? We barely talk now. All, if we do, we argue and cry. You're constantly in your head. You don't really pay attention to me anymore. You're not doing anything wrong, I swear. Trust me, it's not your fault. I'm doing everything wrong. I know you had it tough. I understand that. I can't help you. You need help, babe. You really do. The thing you're going through, it's ruining everything. It's ruining us and it's ruining you. I've not seen you happy in ages. You're right, but I can't help you. It's too much for me. I wish I could, but it's just so fucking hard. I'm sorry. Me too. I never wanted you to feel like this. Not your fault. I just hope you'll be happy one day. A few months later, often we go back to the that day when we broke up after talking to mom. I just knew things wouldn't get better. As much as I loved her, I couldn't take on that responsibility. I couldn't bear more pointless arguments, tiptoeing. We talked a lot, and we tried change to make things make it work a few times, but things just changed too much between us. The worst was moving out. It was our first place, after all. I wish we stayed in touch, but every time we tried to talk, it was just awkward. I hope she's feeling at least better now. Dun dun dun. All right, that's the second ending. Oh lord. I gotta put on some socks, my feet are cold. God dang. Alright, so there's one more ending that was super obvious, and then... How many achievements do we have? Oh, I didn't get the good ending. Okay. I don't know what the hidden achievements are, we probably will not get those, but we're gonna get all the endings. For sure. I think. So I think the other three endings are if I just like ignore her and that we stay together. But I think that's what happens. So what I'm gonna do first is I'm just gonna skip through all, I'm gonna do the same things I just did. And then I'm gonna pick the first option, which means I won't help her. And then I'll do what I did the first time. And then I'll give her that one option. Okay. So there's like a one where you're too overprotective of her 
and you become her only support system. There's one where you basically don't help her at all. And then... You freaking, um... Get the ending I'm about to get. The bad ending, I guess. And then, um... Yeah, so I'm basically... This one, you're not missing anything. I'm just gonna do almost exactly what I did last time, so... I'm just going to do it fast because it's kind of wasting time. And then I'm going to do the first, what I did the first time. And then the second time I'm going to actually play through it like fully so I can try to get the other ending that I don't know how to get yet. The other ending I'm guessing you, I think what I did the first time will probably give me the good ending because I feel like I did it right besides just getting her a therapist. Um, oh wait, I got to put the dishes up. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. We will get all the endings, though, but there's still some hidden achievements. I don't know how we get them, and I'm not going to worry about that too much. I uh, hate spending time on achievements that you don't even... You can't even really read what they're supposed to be. Because it just feels like... Uh, I'm guessing at it, and I don't want to spend my time guessing at hidden achievements, to be honest. Good luck with those, <laughs> but I will get all the endings. It's a it's a good game. It's just a lot of reading. Boop, 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 boop. Go start on dinner. Kind of hard to remember what I'm supposed to be doing when I'm not re reading the actual chat. Do 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 do. Yeah, it's always hard, like, replaying through visual novels to get different endings as well, to be honest. Because I'd rather just get the one that, because you read a lot of the same thing, and a lot of the actions lead to the same things and everything, so it's just... And Joan Vander visiting. Like what, really? Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have just done pizza. Well, that would have been different, so. I'm going to ask her to do the shopping. Sounds like you might do a better job at it. How about you do the shopping and I'll clean the house? At least I won't disappoint you by buying something you don't really, didn't want. Hmm, yeah, that might be a better option. I'll go then. Call me if you need anything. Yeah, have fun. Clean the whole house and she's still not back. It's been a while. Maybe the traffic is bad or she bumped into someone. I don't think there's much else for me to do now. I'll just chill until she comes back. Okay, I'm getting worried. How long can it take someone to do some small shopping? I'll call her. I'm back. I was just going to call you. I started to worry. What? Why? It's been ages. Did something happen? Has it? Oh, well, they didn't have everything I wanted, so I go had to go to different shops, and then I couldn't also couldn't describe, decide on about a few things. What? thought you were buying simple stuff. Well, yeah, but everything is just so unhealthy. Anyway, I'll go start cooking. Okay, do you need help? No, I'll be fine, thanks. They're here in an hour, though. What? Has it been that long? Well, yeah, that's why I was worried. Oh, no, I have to hurry. That was weird. Who spent this hour shopping for food? She seems stressed as well. It's just Joe and Amanda coming around. It's not like it's some family meal. I'd better go help her. Ding dong. Oh, it must be them. I'll go open the door. Hello. This is the same I'm thinking. Do 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 do. On appetite. Dante, Dante, Dante. We had too much wine. Blah blah blah. That's the same. Okay. We're back on track. Oh wait, I gotta get the water first. 
do 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 give me the water maybe I won't go jogging this time as well just see if I find luck into any of the hidden achievements it shouldn't mess anything up too badly for it. clicking that stupid thing I always forget which one does which tragic Do 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 All right. Oh. She wasn't fed already. It's morning and she's not awake, so she obviously wasn't fed. Let's do it. I deserve some breakfast. Da, 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 da. Even when I'm like speeding through this, it takes a while. Why do you care so much? Oh my god. Why does everything you say revolve around looks? Can we not just have a normal conversation? Why do you care so much? Um, I just, I just see what people look like. It's strange that you don't see it. It's strange that I don't have worries and that I have other worries than weight size and weight you literally just gave me a speech about losing weight and working out what it was about me not other people though but that means you care do care about this stuff i want to feel good yeah i don't care what how other people look why would i well why wouldn't you it's important what how is this important feel alive for god's sake fine mr perfect i'll just be just like you then what are you even talking about uh nothing Going for shower. I'm meeting Chloe for coffee today. What the hell? What is wrong with her? Oh, that was stupid and pointless. What's happening to us? I need to calm down. I'll try to do some work. Think about something else. Wrong thing yet again. Do 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 do. Back. All right. Now what am I doing? Something, something. Uh, maybe talk to Alice, I guess. Damn it, I clicked the wrong thing. Every time, dude. Every time. What was I supposed to be doing? Cooking or something? What was my goal? Dante, tell me. Alice is taking a shower right now. So what was I doing? What am I supposed to be doing? I can't remember. Hmm. Dante, help. Not that. Oh, I was supposed to call... What's his face? That's what we're supposed to be doing. There's Steve. Oh, I got a lonely achievement. What's that mean? Try to call everyone on your contact list. There we go. That's a hidden achievement. Let's go. Woo. Only two more hidden achievements. All right. Goggles. Oh, yeah. I was supposed to call Joe. God dang it. Sorry. Give her space. Hey. Do. All right. All right, back to the bed. Goodness gracious. You going to sleep? Yeah, I'm just gonna brush my teeth. Why? Just for asking. Brush our teeth. 
do to do. It's been a long day. Something, something. All squeaky clean. Do, 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 do. I'm just imagining things. It's been a while. She's probably being shy. She loves when I kiss her neck. That'll loosen her up. Stop. What? Just stop, okay? But, but why? We don't want this right now, okay? Okay, okay, I just thought she left. What did I do? Oh, I haven't got that one before. I don't know if it's the hangover or not, but Alice was so difficult today. It's a constant roller coaster, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Next morning. All right. Breakfast time. I'm not feeding him either. I'll see you later, Dante. So much talking. All right. Some time later. Don't even want to touch me. What am I supposed to do to make you happy? I just don't feel like it recently. But why? What am I doing wrong? It's not all about you. I'm not in the mood. Can't you just respect that? Of course I can. I'm sorry. I just feel like everything I do ends up being a mistake. I don't like seeing you like this. I wish I could help you. I know, but I can't force myself to do stuff. You're not doing anything wrong, I swear. Trust me, it's not your fault. But you've had it rough. We need to work this out together. Let's see what happens. But we need to do something about it before it's too late. I'll help you. I'm not sure what we, we can do this together. Maybe. Would you really do that for me? We don't have a choice, sweetheart. We can't keep going like this. We can't keep going like this. It's ruining everything. I haven't seen you happy in ages. You're right. My God, you're right. What's happened to me? I don't want to live like this anymore. I'm so tired. I know you are, baby. I just feel guilty all the time. Whatever I eat, it's too much. I just keep comparing myself to everyone. I hate how myself and how I look. Hopefully you'll be see how beautiful you are soon. We'll get there. Thank you. Alright, which ending did I get? Happily ever after? What the f- What? Help Alice get better? What? How, what? I often, we go back to the day when we decided to take control of her issues. We did a lot of research about recovery and started changing our habits. We've became, become more healthy and we've grown so much together. It's been getting better and even though we still have some issues and she still gets triggered at things. What? How did I get the good ending with the crap I did? What the f- How do I get not a happy ending fell Alice helping Alice get better if that's the good ending? What the f- How? Huh. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> what the hell? I picked all the bad options, didn't I? Oh, we should've ate pizza. How did that end up happily ever after, though? I literally did nothing right. What the hell? Alright, so I'm gonna try to get all the achievements one more time. I keep, like, talking myself out of it. And then I talk myself back into it, so... This one, I guess I'm supposed to semi try to help her, but not. It's weird, dude. I don't know. There's one achievement that's... I think one of the uh, hidden achievements is not to talk to the cat. So... She's still in there, so let's wait. Yeah, I think that's one of the achievements. Like, one of the hidden achievements is not to talk to the cat. And then... Oh, she's in the bathroom. Hold on, though. What's that sound? Is she crying? No, it's... What's going on? Come in. Alright. Back. And I guess I go to sleep. Don't touch the cat. The cat's in, trying to kill my achievement. I think what I'm going to do this time is I'm going to, um... 
get her wine instead of getting her something healthy from the store, and I'm going to avoid Joe and them. What to eat? What to eat? Cereal. All right. Let's do this. Check the cupboards. All right. Talking about our conspiracy with the cereal again, like in my first playthrough. Go do our homework. Code. Back. Go use the bathroom. Like, that's a good thing to do. Yay, I got the do you need to go achievement, so you just go to the bathroom and open the lid at that time of the day. I don't know if it's a certain time, but that's an achievement. There you go. It's one of the hidden ones. Okay. All right, now I just got to figure out two of the endings, and I feel like the last hidden achievement is just not to touch the cat. Don't touch the cat. That's an achievement, I'm pretty sure. Let's go make dinner. Worried about your eating. What what do you mean? Da, 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 da. Found lots of wrappings. You know, I was looking for my pen today and I checked your bag, the one in the bedroom. There's a lot of chocolate bar wrapping and stuff. I've been barely eating at home and so I was thinking, is something wrong? Um no, it's nothing like that. Is it because of stress or something? No no. I just had some bad cravings some time ago. Must have forgotten to throw them out. Forgot, huh? Maybe, but it's still unlike her. She used to give me a hard time about a few unwashed dishes. Hard to imagine she'd keep a pile of trash in her bag. She's probably making stuff up to avoid the reason, talking about the whole real reason for all of this. You don't have to hide things from me. All right. Let's go back on track. I don't know what, I'm just trying something else. So maybe I have a chance of getting that one ending. Good idea. No harm in Googling stuff, right? Give it an old Google. I think. Don't touch the cat. <laughs> it's like against my second nature not to touch the cat. I want to give the cat a pet. Not eating. Tiredness. Vomiting. Boom. Bulimia. That's it. All right, tell her. Isn't there a way to fix this? Can't imagine how she's feeling right now, but she's clearly struggling. It's clear to me, though, that she needs to take some action and find a way through this, or it will only get worse. There must be a way to fix this, right? You need to find something before it gets worse, babe. Yeah, I know. Maybe you can find something useful stuff online. Maybe. Whatever you do, it has to be now, otherwise things will get worse, you know that. Yeah, you're right, I'll try. I think she agrees with me, I hope she will actually do something. I know it's a lot for her, but I'm sure she can sort herself out. What time are they coming again? I think he said around 6. Okay, we should start get started on cleaning up then. Yes, boss. And actually decide what we're making for dinner. We so... we've already done that one. Okay, we've done this. I wouldn't want her to feel bad about eating it, but then at least everyone else would be happy. Maybe she should... What should we go with? Roast vegetables. I know this is really important to her. 
I think that vegetable recipe sounds great, babe. Let's try it out. Are you sure? But what if they don't like it? Well, then they can host the next turn. There won't be any cleaning to do, but why wouldn't they like it? It sounds good, and you're an awesome cook, so bring it on. Okay, I'll make a shopping list then. I made the list. I've added a few bits for the rest of the week as well. Okay, sounds good. I wrote exactly what kind of stuff to buy. Make sure you get it. Try to get it, okay? Um, yeah, of course. Let me see. Skim milk, low-fat cheese. Yeah, okay. Oh, and for sauce, make sure you get exactly the brand I wrote down. It's much better. Uh, I feel like I'm destined to fail this. Maybe I should ask her. No, we're going to do it. You might get the doting one. Do the shopping myself. Hey, I'm a big boy. I can do the shopping. I know you can. I just want to make sure you get the right things. It will be fine. Don't stress. I'll get all the perfect things. Okay, I'll start cleaning the house. Yeah, ring me if you remember every, anything else. Check my phone. See if she asked me about the... No. I came to the biggest store, but they don't have everything. I guess I could go to a different store, but I don't want to spend the whole day shopping. Okay. Don't know if I'm... Go to a different store. Phew, I managed to get everything. Time to go back. I'm back. Jeez, how long did this take to do shopping? I'm happy to see you too. I went to a few different shops as they didn't have everything in one place. You don't want to come back with something you wouldn't like, you know. Sorry it took so long. Are you serious? Thanks, babe. I really appreciate it. No problem. I'll start cooking then. Phew, I guess it was a good decision in the end. It took me a while, but to see the fit smile on her face definitely made it worth it. I hope she's feeling better. Ding dong. Oh, it must be them. I'll go to the door. Oh, don't touch the cat. Oh, don't touch the cat. Actually, let me go talk to her real quick. Let me see. Cooking, I won't bother her. Okay, fair. Fair. Oh, hey, long time no see. Okay, I've already done these. Bon Appetit. Oh, Ellis, this looks amazing. I hope it tastes amazing. You made it, so I'm sure it does. Let's try it. Okay, so good. Okay, we've done this already. Okay. Dun -dun. Even the chef is munching on it like crazy. Haha. -ha. Oh, we did so good. Um, I haven't really eaten today, so... You know, I don't want the wine to hit me and... Oh shit, this isn't good. She's been eating quite a lot, to be fair. Seems like she's stressed out about something. That comment is not going to help with that, though. I'll just distract them. We all gotta eat after that wine. Man, it kicked hard. me hard. Haha. -ha. I... Th Starting to think you added something to it. Now why would I do that when I know you're such a lightweight anyways? Burn. It's on, woman. <laughs> we gotta solve it with a good old drinking competition. Hmm, I'll take that challenge. We need more alcohol. Good. Glad they didn't notice anything. I hope she's not gonna let that comment get to her. I just have to make sure we're all having fun and spend a nice evening together. We had too much wine. After finishing Joe's bottle, Amanda set us to go get more. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. We're killing it, I think. We're uh, Just let me get one of the other endings, please. My god, the thirst, the headache. I hate wine. Water shower. That was definitely a different thing, though. Luckily she ate last night, but I'm pretty sure she threw it all up later in the evening. I hope she'll be alright today. Anyway, time for a shower. I need to wash off this headache. No, don't touch the cat. Get out of here, cat. <laughs> oh, lord. I hope I get another ending this time. Please. I think I've put on weight recently. Well, that's not surprising, really. Working from home, not moving at all. Oh, well, I guess I have to stop with the snacks and get more active. Hmm, I wonder if... What Alice thinks when she looks at herself. She has such an amazing body, it's hard to imagine her being... To look at her for hours. Even if, why would being super thin bother you so much? She shouldn't get so down. I just... Man, I need a shower. So much better. Oh, or not. My head's spinning. 
All right. Let's go running. Why don't we ask her to go with us? God dang it. I think I messed up. I think I wasn't supposed to go meet with Joe that night, actually. God dang it. Whatever. I am too... <laughs> I always think, oh, I get them confused so bad. Let's do it. Let's do it. Breakfast time. Morning. Oh, hey, you're up. How are you feeling? Don't even start. Thanks, babe. Did you go on a run? I did. It was feeling really rough, so I thought, it's actually awesome. Didn't know I still had it in me. All right, how did it go? Better than I thought, actually. I forgot how good exercising feels. I used to work out a lot, remember? I want to try and do it more often. Yeah, sounds good. Are you okay? Me? Of course. Faced out a bit. Did I say something wrong? No, no, I just... It's the hangover, I guess. All oh, right. well, maybe we should start running together. It might help with the stress as well. Um, yeah, I guess so. Don't feel like you have to. I'm just pumped up right now. I'll think about it. Hmm, we used to work together, out together quite a bit. Why is she suddenly so weird about it? I mean, she could at least show some support. Maybe it's the hangover. Anyway, did you enjoy last night? It was nice. Joe has put on a lot of weight, though. He used to look so good, and now... Ouch, I get what you mean, but it's not our business to judge. I guess it's the stress at work. He didn't mention they have a couple of big clients. I guess so. As long as Amanda's still happy with him, that's all that matters. Yeah. You look great. I think she lost weight. Didn't really notice. Um, she's fine, I guess. Don't you think she's attractive? She's pretty, yeah, but I didn't really notice if she... Okay. Get this. How, what was I supposed to do now? Work, maybe? Haven't been very productive lately. Why did you get so upset this morning? Did I do something wrong? No, of course you didn't. I get just... So great, I just can't stop comparing myself to her. I didn't know. I wouldn't expect you to, but she literally looks the same. I think she lost... Excuse me. She lost some weight. So what? You're still the hottest person in the room. Ah, thank you for saying that. I just get stuck in my head sometimes, I guess. Hmm. And then you went on a run. I just thought about how unfit I am. Maybe. Da, 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 da. I guess I just felt kind of jealous and guilty. Could work out together. You're right. Don't feel pressured or anything. It's just, if you think you could help, then I'm happy to do it with you. I'd like that. Okay, then. Oh, I got a message. Can I ignore the message? What photo did you get? I have all the photos. Yeah, I already have all the photos. I don't know why I got a photo. Okay. Uh, I ignore him. I feel like if I make him breakfast, I'm gonna be in trouble. Fine, you get food. Not gonna make it. Must have her reasons. Uh, 
that out uh, all right please just give me another ending please please dude <laughs> fine now but it didn't feel great I can tell you that I know I'm sorry I canceled like that I was just so overwhelmed I didn't want to ruin another thing I know you've had it tough recently I know you're going through a tough period but you're taking it out on me too like with Amanda you had to go at me because you were jealous you had no reason to be uh, please give me another ending been together for so long now some other girl blah 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 I already got that <sighs> you do we argue you cry you're constantly in your head you don't even pay attention to me and you're not doing anything wrong I swear we need to work through this <sighs> You don't have a choice, sweetheart. You can't keep going like this. We can't keep- oh, I'm gonna get the damn good end again. I don't want to live like this anymore. I'm so tired. I know you are, baby. I feel guilty all the time. Whatever I eat, it's too much. Blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna get the good ending. I fucking suck. Support system. Yes, I got a different ending. Thank God. I often go back to the day when we were decided to take control of her issues. We did a lot of research. But about recovery and start changing our habits. We've become more healthy and we've grown so much closer. She's been getting better and even though we still have some issues and still get and she still gets triggered by some things, I know we can deal with all of it one way or another. I hope she'll become more independent though. Ever since it all started, I've been her only support and sometimes it just gets to me. It just gets too much. I've pretty much given up on my private life to make sure she's fine. I am happy she's better, I really am, but I wonder if we could ever get to where we used to be. Maybe we really do need a specialist. Thank God we got a different ending, dude. Oh my God. So now we're just missing two achievements. We're missing the cat achievement, however you get that. And the not a happy ending achievement. I don't know how you get the cat achievement though, because I thought it was, the achievement's called Tough Guy, and it had a picture of a cat, so I figured it was just like not petting the cat. But thank God we got a different ending. Now we have to figure out how to get the ending that's bad, but it's not breaking up ending. So I have to do it just bad enough. Hmm. Okay. Just bad enough that she doesn't break up with me but it doesn't work out. Damn. Hard, dude. Oh, how do I do the cat thing, though? Do I have to talk to the cat a ton, or like, what's up? Maybe I have to talk to the cat like every day or something. Where's the cat at? Maybe I talk to the cat before I go to bed. Hey, buddy. Oh, my little fluff ball. How you doing, Dante? Give me the achievement cat. <laughs> okay, what was I supposed to do? Hey buddy. What bothers me though is I tried to do the bad ending one time and I got the good ending while I was doing it. So you have to find like a really niche. You have to do something very specific with the um, bad, like the semi bad ending. I don't know what it is though. I'm so freaking struggle. Okay. We'll do the best we can. I didn't mean to click that. Get off me. I'm just glad we got one of the other endings finally. Yes, I got the achievement. I don't know. Ah, oh, Dante, I didn't see you there. I don't know why I got it, though. Head Dante 50 times. That's how you get it. Okay, we're missing one achievement now. We just gotta get the last ending, boys. And we did every achievement. Oh my god, dude.
All right, we're not going to help her somehow. What do we do here? How do I not help her? But still get to an ending where... Ugh, magic, dude. I really don't know how to get this ending. I feel like we need to know that she has Blemia to get to that ending. But we still need to pick bad choices. What was I doing? Oh, dinner. Yeah. All right. Sorry, I haven't been talking to this last part, but I've been trying this game for a hot minute now. I keep. up is not the answer i don't really get why you force yourself to throw up or there's some medications why be so drastic i know didn't think it's not normal to force yourself to throw up well no why all the questions anyway i told you i don't feel good don't do it anymore okay it's not like uh, it's going to help with anything yeah i'm sorry okay that was different Okay, so, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, I just, whew, I've been trying this for a hot minute, and I've actually tried to upload the video a couple times with, like, out all the endings, but I'm like, man, I don't want to, like, I want to get all the endings. I actually need to go to Steam and, like, remove my <laughs> review, because I'm going to replay through it all. Okay, I didn't upload the review yet. I don't think. Did I? Back to the game. Not eating, tiredness, vomiting, bulimia. Tell her. Maybe I should have not told her though. Hi, I'm doing the shopping myself. I'm not going to. I'm going to shop here, make her mad, hopefully. All right. Okay, I made that bad joke again. Let's see. Shower.
Yeah, I'm scared to do too many right things, because if I do too many right things, then... Uh... I'll get the good ending still, so... Game and time. I keep dying. Alright, now we go get beer with Joe. Yo, Joe. Mama son. Do 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 breakfast time feed the cat no he wasn't what am I supposed to do take a shower something I'm supposed to do something uh, not that too early to shower maybe I'm supposed to use the bathroom huh she's throwing up Okay. All right. Let's meet the Mama Son. And I feel like the last interactions are going to be super important to get in the thing where I try to help her, but I don't. And hopefully, don't get the good ending. Do the best we can. All right. What do you need then? Huh? You're saying I'm not helping you, but you're not really letting me help. Every time I ask what's wrong with you, you change the subject. I can't read your mind, can I? I don't expect you to, but you could just be a bit more understanding. How am I not understanding? I'm not, I've given you nothing but support. I don't even know what's going on. How am I supposed to understand it? I don't really know either. I just don't feel good. Everything is so overwhelming. It's, I see it's hard on you too, but what am I supposed to do? Talk to me. You acted all weird in front of our friends. I get having a bad day, but you didn't even apologize. You're just acting like nothing happened. And then you have a go at me because of some silly stuff. And you won't even talk to me. Can you see where I'm coming from? Yes, you're right. I'm sorry I've been like this. I don't really know what's going on with me. What happened this morning? What do you mean? You didn't feed Dante and you threw up. How do you know that? You didn't clean up. Oh, um, freaked out. Why? I was getting ready for work and... And... And I just... Nothing fit me. I freaked out. You look fine. I don't feel fine. I can see that. Honestly, you look good. Just like always. I'm serious. Nothing's changed. I think you need help. What? You're not well. This is serious. I... Honestly, you need a therapist before it gets worse. Maybe you're right. Yeah. You haven't been yourself for a while now. It's gotten out of hands. I'm sorry. Me too. I never thought it would get this bad. I know I never wanted it either. Damn it, dude. I don't know how to get the last ending. I don't know how to help you. I wish I did, but I'm lost. I know. It's not your fight. I'm sorry. It's been tough on you too. I'll try to get some help. Yes, I got it! Thank God! Oh, yes! Oh my God, all the endings. We got all the achievements. We're the best, boys. Let's go. Thank you guys for watching. I'm so glad we got it because I was going to give up. But don't give up. Don't let your dreams be memes. Get to the end. Push, boys. Hard work is rewarded. I often go back to that day when I wanted to talk. 
we were really set on like making things better and it in the beginning it worked but i don't really know what happened we just argued so much all the time she's gotten more and more distant and in the end we just decided to go separate ways it was too mu just too much to handle and we both had enough i just try to remember what my mom told me it is not my responsibility to heal someone else but i just i keep thinking what if i'd supported her better what if i was more understanding yes dude Yes. All right, guys. I'm going to put time steps to all the achievements. Thanks for watching. I'm so glad I... Oh, because I gave up on this game like four different times. Like in one night. Because I've been playing this from like... What time is it? From like 12 p.m. Or 12 a.m. To like 3.30 in the morning. Uh, which I always play late at night. But I've been playing this for like a solid four hours. Trying to like off and on. Trying to get these achievements. It was tearing me apart, bro. Because it was uploading on YouTube. And then I started playing PoE, and I was like, no, I gotta get all the achievements. I gotta do it, boys. And we did it. Alright, guys. Bye!